what we are concerned with is the understanding of the whole process of life with all its complexity, with its aggressions and miseries, with its sorrows and confusions and agonies. And to understand this vast field of life, which is a constant movement, one must not only hear the words, but also go beyond the words. Because the words, the explanations, are not the facts. Then one can look. Then one can listen. And that act of listening is a really a miracle. Perhaps it's the greatest miracle. When one can listen totally, without any defense, without any barrier, on a mission, why are they shooting these victims over their view of religion, yeah, why do we all search for love like we got Cupid's addiction, why would politicians, you can't tell the truth from the fiction, why do we pollute where we're living, why are these youth put at risk, and why is this ruling dominion kept us consuming this prison, nah, 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 I won't jump through the hoops of the system, nothing stands between you and the pursuit of your vision, I grab a loop with this rhythm, it puts the juice in my pistol to jump back, react, spit in the boots with precision, and when I'm cruising with ism, yeah, I'm deucing the split, and it's a B and E show, bitch. Getting loose was a given I don't want them to look back when the future is written And know we killed ourselves with nuclear fission and stupid decisions Shit, I'd rather an asteroid do for collision And know the planet got fucked by the human condition Sing the tune with conviction All I know is the sun is shining Yet we fight all through the night While the birds are melting and the sea is rising I don't know I don't know the future. 
I didn't come here to tell you how this is going to end. I came here to tell you how it's going to begin. Where we go from there is a choice I leave to you. I'm trying to free your mind from here, but I can only show you the door. You're the one that has to walk through. Remember, all I'm offering is the truth. Nothing more. Everything that has a beginning has an end. We are all everything at once. To understand is to transform what is. Not accept things as they are. If it's true that we're all from the center of a star, every atom in each of us from the center of the star, then we're all the same thing. And therefore, it's only me out there. So what is there to be afraid of? What is there that needs solace? Nothing. There's nothing to be afraid of because it's all us. The trouble is we have been separated by being born and given a name and an identity and being individuated. We've been separated from the oneness and that's what religion exploits, that people have this yearning to be part of the overall one again. So they exploit that. They call it God. They say he has rules. And I think it's cruel. I think you can do it absent from it. The real revolution is the revolution of consciousness. Because in this there is no teacher, no pupil, there's no leader, there's no guru, there's no master, no savior. You yourself are the teacher and the pupil, you are the master, you are the guru, you are the leader. You are everything. How would we explain all this to a dispassionate extraterrestrial observer? What account would we give of our stewardship of the planet Earth? We have heard the rationales offered by the superpowers. We know who speaks for the nations. But who speaks for the human species? Who speaks for Earth? A new consciousness is developing which sees the Earth as a single organism and recognizes that an organism at war with itself is doomed. We are one planet. racial, sexual, and religious chauvinism to rabid nationalist fervor are beginning not to work. This is who I am and whether I'm good or bad or achieving or not, all that's learned along the way. Just ride. And we can change it anytime we want. It's only a choice. No effort, no work, no job, no savings of money. You realize that I had the game wrong. The game was to find out what I already was.